What's up guys? Welcome back to Newbie Style. So guys, in today's video, I'm going to show you guys how you guys can glitch out the Blocks Fruit Gacha to give yourself a mythical fruit for absolutely free, guys. Yes, guys, every time you do this glitch, you would basically get yourself a mythical fruit from the Blocks Fruit Gacha. So I'm basically going to show you guys how to do this glitch in this video. So yeah, guys, let's get on to this video. So the first thing you're going to have to do is basically go ahead and go over to the Pirate Star area in the uh, like the first sea so as you guys can see i'm currently in the pirate start area in the first sea now i guess get you just click on the set home point guy click on accept just like that basically set your home point now after i've done that all you guys get do just basically fly over to middle town so first off go ahead and go over to middle town guys you guys can use anything to get over to here so basically use anything so you guys can use a fruit a boat anything guys so uh, yeah now when you're over here all you guys can do just first off talk to the weapons dealer just like this so i'm just gonna click on musket right here you don't have to purchase or click on anything guys so you guys can do just interact with this guy and that should do the trick now after i've done that all you guys can do just go ahead and go over to the back of this mansion right here and you should be the blocks for dealer now i guess i do just click on him just like this and basically click on every single like uh, uh, mythical fruit that you want so basically all you guys can do just click on every single mythical fruit just like this do not click on legendary guys because if you guys click on legendary uh, the glitch would like not work okay so uh, yeah all right uh, basically leopard and the spirit is uh, what i want so i'm just gonna basically click on those two so uh, it, there's no guarantee that you will get yourself uh, only the uh, leopard and the spirit it could be any other like a mythical fruit guys i'm basically doing that to increase the chances of getting the leopard and the spirit so uh, yeah now after i've done that all you guys can do is just basically go ahead and go back to the pirate start area so as you guys can see, I am getting back to the prior starter area. Now when you're here, go ahead and go over to the blocks with dealer and basically do the same thing that we did earlier. So basically click on the view on the, uh, like the, uh, the mythical fruits that you want. So, uh, yeah, just like this, as you guys can see. Now after I've done that, all you guys can do is just go ahead and go over to the bandit quest giver, click on this guy, click on bandits, click on confirm and basically get yourself a quest. Now after you get that quest, all you guys can do is just complete it just like this, kill 5 bandits just like this and you should complete the quest. Now after you complete the quest, all you guys can do is just basically go ahead and go into the bandit quest giver, click on this guy, click on bandits, click on confirm and basically get the quest again. After you do that, all you guys can do is just abandon it just like that and basically click on track on your current quest just like that now after you've done that way guys can do just go ahead and go over to the blocks with dealer again click on continue and click on the two uh like not two basically any like mythical fruit that you want to get to increase the chances of getting that fruit guys okay so uh, yeah just like that now after i've done that all you guys can do is just basically go ahead and go over to middle town again so i'm just gonna fly over to middle town so as you guys can see i'm basically going over to middle town so uh, yeah guys, so basically get over middle town. Now when you're over middle town, all you guys can do is just basically go ahead and go over to the boat dealer, click on free and basically get yourself the free boat. Now you guys can do just sit on the free boat just like this, drive it a little just like that. Now you guys can do just basically try to use one of your like, uh, uh, like fruit abilities while sitting down. So basically just uh, stand up and basically sit down and use the uh, like the fruit ability again. So just like this. As you guys can see, I think I don't think I did that correctly, so I'm just gonna do it again. I just need to uh, wait until my uh, heat beam like uh, refreshes. So okay, not that. All right. So three, two, one. Okay, not that again. Okay, completely missed it. Completely missed it again. Oh wait, I did it. Wait. Oh, I didn't even... Yeah, I did it. As you guys can see, it, uh, like, uh, did the refresh thing. So, uh, yeah. Now, after I've done that, all you guys can do just basically take that boat over to the pirate starter area. So, uh, basically, just uh, use the boat, guys. Do not use anything else. Because if you guys use anything else, the glitch would not work, okay? So, basically, just take the boat 
over to parasite area like that i'm doing right now so as you guys can see so uh, in this case if you guys have like a private boat thing or you guys can do just go to that if you guys have if you guys like don't have the private boat thing go ahead and go over to the normal boat thing like right here so basically i'm just gonna go ahead and go to the luxury boat the pirate like the pie okay what can i speak the private boat thing so uh, yeah basically the luxury boat is the private boat thing so uh anyways all you guys can do just basically change that to the free one in like the luxury boat thing and if you guys don't have the luxury boat thing all you guys can do is just go ahead and go to here and basically change into any of these uh, like ships guys you can even do the free one again so uh, yeah now after i've done that all you guys can do just basically sit on the boat just like this all you guys can do just basically just drive it a little just like that now after i've done that jump off the boat use your fruit ability and basically jump into water and die while pushing the boat so if you guys are the shark race you have to basically like uh, uh, push the boat and research yourself guys okay yeah, only if you guys are the shark race because shark race can actually swim so uh, yeah so now i guess get you just basically go ahead and go over to the boat again just like this now when you're back in the boat basically drive it straight to middletown just like this all right and we are in middle town now i guess get you just go ahead and go to the boat dealer click on this guy click on free and basically change it to the free one now all you guys can do is basically get yourself a fruit so i'm basically go ahead and go over to the uh, like the jungle area where there is the blocks with gacha so everybody knows that so yeah all you guys can do is just basically go ahead and go over to that uh, guy right there and basically get yourself a fruit so you need to have enough money to get yourself a fruit in this part guys okay so uh, yeah all right i'm just gonna get myself a fruit all right random bye and I got myself the worst fruit in the game, the bomb fruit. Okay, anyways, all you guys gotta do is just basically go ahead and go back to, like, the middle town. Now you're gonna have to sacrifice the fruit that you got. So if you guys got, like, a really good fruit, don't, uh, like, uh, sacrifice it, guys, okay? Keep that fruit and basically wait the two hours and get yourself uh, a different fruit uh, from, uh, like, the Broxwood Gacha. So, uh, yeah, all you guys gotta do is just now basically, like, uh, like, sit on the boat just like this. Take your bomb uh, like uh, fruit out. So I got myself the bomb fruit. So I'm just gonna uh, basically put the bomb fruit here. All you guys gotta do just drop it over here. All right, I messed it up. All right, let's do that again. And as you guys can see, the bomb fruit is in the uh, like the uh, like the boat. So yeah, all you guys gotta do just now change the boat, guys. Okay, just change the boat to any boat that you like. You guys can even do the free one again. So I'm basically gonna do the free one. And as you guys can see. The fruit is still there. Okay, wait, what? The fruit is still there? Okay, anyways, uh, don't do the free one, guys. If the fruit is still there, the glitch would not work, okay? So basically, just uh, change the boat to a different boat. So I change it to a slope and... Let me see if the fruit is there. Okay, the fruit isn't there. So basically, change it to a slope, guys. So you guys cannot do the free one because it just doesn't do it i didn't do that when i did the glitch first so i didn't actually know so uh, yeah now after i've done that all you guys can do is just basically go ahead and go over to the fruit gacha again so basically just fly over to the fruit gacha or you guys can basically take the boat that you like just got so just basically get over to the fruit gacha now when you're back at the fruit gacha all you guys can do is just click on this guy click on all right click on random fruit and basically click on buy again and he should give you guys the way to our uh, prompt now after you've done that all you guys can do is just go ahead and go over to the quest giver click on this guy click on gorilla king click on accept and basically get yourself the gorilla king quest all right what is this dude doing okay why is he trying to kill me wow okay where is this dude you messed with the wrong guy! Seriously? What is he trying to do? Why is he hiding? Damn! Whoa! Alright, I finally got rid of that guy, so... Oh, never mind, I didn't get rid of that guy. That was not the guy. 
All right. Uh, I gotta get out of the transformation to use my ability. And just a little bit more. What is he doing? He's just running. All right, I killed him finally. Seriously, dude. Why you keep running after getting yourself uh, into a fight? Seriously, that is just embarrassing. So, uh, yeah, and now after I've done that, all you guys can do is just go ahead and go over to the block food gacha again. Click on all right and click on random fruit. Oh, wait, we did that already. Seriously? Five minutes later. All right, that was a long fight. That did kill me and I killed him again. So uh, I basically uh, stopped at... Uh, okay, so I remember. I basically stopped at uh, going to like the... Uh, uh, the, uh, the 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 Gorlakin. So uh, yeah, basically all you guys can do is just get yourself the Gorlakin quest. So uh, yeah. All right, I'm just gonna get myself the Gorlakin quest again. Just like this. So basically get yourself with the Gorilla King quest. Now I guess I do just basically go over to the Gorilla King and basically kill that guy. So just like this. Just kill him. Now after I've done that, all you guys got to do is just go ahead and go over to the Pirate Starter area again. So alright. That is not the Pirate Starter area. Where is the Pirate Starter area? I kind of got lost. Okay, so that place right there. I need to turn off my hockey. So yeah, we guys can do this. Go ahead and go over to the Pirate Starter area. Okay, and we are here. Now, when you're back in the Pirate Starter area, all you guys can do is just go ahead and go to the Marine Recruiter. Click on this guy. Click on Join. Just like this. Now, after you do all those things, all you guys can do is just basically wait until the Bloxwood Dealer Shop refreshes. Now, after your, like the Bloxwood Dealer Shop refreshes, you should basically get yourself a, a mythical fruit every time you basically roll with the Bloxwood Gacha. So, yeah, this would stop at about two fruits. All you guys can do is just basically do the glitch again, and you should get yourself an, uh, like another two mythical fruits after you do the glitch and uh, basically get a fruit from the Bloxwood Gacha. So, yeah, guys, that is basically from me i guess i'll see you guys in my next video bye bye